Hey y'all, it's Brianna. Welcome back to my channel. So today's vlog is going to be me getting ready to be a bridesmaid. I'm super excited. This is my first time ever being a bridesmaid. My cousin is getting married this weekend, so I'm gonna take you guys along with me as much as possible to kind of get ready. Um, so today is Tuesday. The wedding is on Saturday, but I'm actually leaving tomorrow. So I have about 24 hours to kind of pack my things and get everything ready and I'm kind of doing this last minute there's a couple of things that I should have been doing a couple of weeks ago but basically what I want to accomplish today is I need to go find a dress for the dress rehearsal which is the day before the wedding something to do with my hair so I'm doing my own hair and makeup um, I might actually do like a trial makeup run today I think I do need to go pick up a couple of makeup things um, my hair is curly. I'm not straightening it. Don't think that you guys have to straighten your hair for formal events. Um, yeah, I'm kind of scared. I don't know what to do with my hair. If you guys have curly hair, you know that it can look completely different every single day. Um, so I'm not sure what to do. I want to buy something like a clip or some type of formal looking, um, hair accessory. I need earrings. I need to just go get a lot of stuff done. Tomorrow I'm actually getting my nails done. I think I'm gonna do my own toes today. Um, eyebrows, I have had, oh, something's on my face. I've had so many negative experiences getting my eyebrows done, so I only do my own eyebrows. I'll probably do that later today. But yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along with me. I'll also try on my dress in this video to show you guys what it looks like and have details of the dress down below. Enough rambling, I'm just gonna take you guys along with me to get ready for this wedding I'm super excited for. Getting a few things from Target, trying to see if there is a dress I can wear to the dress rehearsal. Just went to Dunkin' to get some fuel and she forgot to ring it in, so I got a free iced coffee. Okay, that was the most unsuccessful trip ever. I was gone for like two hours, went to a ton of different stores. All I found was a pair of earrings um let me show you guys from the store in the mall called louisa just a pair of kind of sparkly silver oh if i can get it out just a pair of sparkly silver dangly earrings and then from target i just got some baking soda because i need to clean some things and then I got a new beauty sponge because mine is getting kind of dirty and some more deodorant. I like to get this Tom's men's deodorant, but yeah, that was a super unsuccessful trip. Um, I'm gonna order like Target pickup to get some hair gel that I forgot to get and also this brush for my edges. And I still need to find a dress or something to wear to the dress rehearsal, but I'm kind of tired, it's only noon, and I'm just like exhausted, so probably just gonna pack my things today. There's really not much else I need. I just didn't really find a dress for the dress rehearsal. I already have heels I'm going to wear, and yeah, I'm pretty tired, so I'm gonna eat some lunch, and I'll be back. Okay, so today is Wednesday. I was supposed to be leaving to go to Kansas today, but we're actually leaving tomorrow. So I'm about to go get my nails done. These things are looking crusty and dusty right now. Um, I'm doing gel, I don't know what color, probably like a nude. Um, and I'm probably gonna do almond shapes. So I'm gonna get my nails done and then I want to do like a test hair, makeup, put the dress on, earrings on, try some heels and see how the entire thing is going to look. So I'm gonna do that today. The hair is really what I'm struggling with. Um, so I'm probably just going to test all that out today. I'm about to go get my nails done. And then also I need to pack my stuff today. So that is what we're doing on this lovely Wednesday. Okay, here are my nails. I got an almond, like a shorter almond shape, and then this like lilac gray color. Cost $50, and I tipped her $6, so it was pretty expensive, but nails are ready. <laughs> 
Okay, just got back from nails and I went to Target and got a couple of things. I got this brush to help kind of slick my edges, some long bobby pins. Not sure if I'm gonna use these, but these are some big like pearl beaded barrettes. And then a foundation, hopefully it's the right shade, and some highlighter. I am starving, so I'm gonna eat some lunch and then do a test full hair, makeup, face beat and put my dress on with shoes and show you guys what it looks like. About to make, I just poked myself, about to make a veggie burger and then I will transform to kind of practice what I'm gonna do on actual wedding day. Okay, so I'm gonna do my hair and makeup to just practice what I'm gonna do on wedding day. My hair right now, I just washed it yesterday and so it's not like fully volumized yet. The wedding is outdoors, so she told us to either do an updo or like half up, half down. I think I'm gonna do half up, half down. I just wanna kind of practice. Right now my hair has kind of a diagonal part. Um, so let's see. I can't braid or do anything fancy. So normally I use clips, but obviously this type of clip isn't very formal. So I have really long black bobby pins and then um, I got these, which I'll have to check with the bride if this would be okay to wear because it's kind of like pearly. But let me just see what we can do today's wednesday so by saturday my hair is gonna have a lot more volume um so let me just kind of play around and see what i can come up with Okay, I'm gonna clip it back with this until I open up the other clips. And then I'm just putting some edge gel on the sides. I wanted to maybe find something to like intertwine in the twist, but I couldn't find anything cute that didn't look like cheap or tacky. So I might just not do that. Okay, maybe that's it for hair. This side, I might need to put more of it back. Ah. So normally I don't do liquid foundation. I do a powder, but I think I'm gonna try this and see how it looks. I just kind of want light coverage, nothing super cakey. Um, hopefully this is my shade. Let me see. Mm. This looks way light. This looks way light. Hmm. Actually, I don't know, I can't tell, like it looks really light, but maybe it oxidizes. Let me just do a full face and see. But it does look, it looks like concealer. God. <laughs> okay, yeah, um, I need a darker shade. Okay, so let me go wipe this off because this is just not, it's not going to be the right color. Okay, so I do have another foundation. Um, I wanted a matte one so that I don't get oily. Um, I don't think this one is. I already packed all my makeup because I thought I was leaving. So I need to unpack it. Okay, so I think I'm gonna use this liquid one that I already have, which is, this is a ColourPop's Pretty Fresh Foundation. Yeah, this one is hydrating, it's not matte. So I think I'm gonna do a light layer of this, and then my typical powder foundation that is matte is this Bare Minerals matte one, like gently go over it with that, just because my skin gets really 
really oily and this wedding is outdoors so there's gonna be sun maybe some sweat and I just want to yeah see this one is a lot more brown <laughs> Okay, concealer is from that same color pop line. I'm just gonna put a little incy teensy bit of concealer. <laughs> gonna take some Makeup Revolution banana powder and bake a little bit. Blush is Wet n Wild, the shade Mellow Wine. Oh, I forgot to go over. I'm gonna take a fluffy brush and lightly just go over everything with my matte Bare Minerals. Gonna bronze just a little bit. This is just a Morphe Brontour. Nothing too crazy. Okay, mm, I'm not trying to do like a lot of makeup. I'm gonna do a little bit of the bronzer as my eyeshadow. This is just a very basic look. Okay, mm, eyebrows. I don't really do a whole lot with my eyebrows. I'm just gonna gently fill them in with this elf pencil and then I have a tinted brow gel from ColourPop that I'm gonna put over it. Okay, I have never worn lashes before. I just do mascara. This mascara I love is from Ilia, so I'm gonna put on some mascara. I got this new highlight from Target. This is also from Makeup Revolution, the shade Dare to Divulge. Let me see what this one looks like. I got it open. This is what it looks like. So it's pretty. Let's see what it looks like. And I don't want it to be blinding, just like a little. Oh, it's a lot. Oh, yeah, this stuff is kind of powerful. So just a little dab. And a little bit, actually it's not a little bit, and some on the inner corner. Okay, and for lips, I think I'm just going to do gloss. Got my Fenty Gloss Balm. I swear I've had this for like two or three years. I'm still on my first bottle or first tube. Okay, I think this is the look. Of course, on the actual day, I will put on my stunning spray, which I have, oh my gosh, um, Makeup Revolution Hydrating Matte Spray. And then I also will bring this, this is Maybelline Superstay with me in case I need to like dab out some oiliness because your girl is going to get oily. But I think this is how I'm going to do my makeup and then afterwards I probably will go back and like fix my edges because some of the makeup got in them. Still not 100% sold on the hair, I think it's just uneven. Um, but let me go put on earrings, the dress, and see how everything looks all together. Okay, I'm back. So the dress is not on all the way because I can't do the top part by myself. So it will look like more tight, this part. These are the earrings that I'm going to wear and then I will have my second hole in. Of course, I'm not going to have this on and where is my... I might wear this pearl bracelet, but I have to ask the bride if it's okay, if I can even do pearls, because I know that she wanted silver. Okay, yeah, so the dress is like falling down, um, because the pearls would match that clip in the back of my head, but I have to double check. If not, I probably just will wear my rings and not have a bracelet. This is what the dress looks like. Um, it's like a halter with this part cut. It is padded, which I don't like, but I can't really change that. The back, again, I have to have someone do it for me because I can't, 
but this part ties and then this top part will clip together and let me how can i give you guys a better angle of the whole thing let me like back up and show you guys what the bottom looks like okay so full length and it has a slit right here um this dress is from a website called azazi it was only like 90 dollars. shipping was free super fast and it's custom no this video is not sponsored but i will link my dress down below in the website um super cheap very cute dress i love the way it fits and i got a size six which <laughs> i didn't think it was gonna fit because i'm like an eight so i've been trying to run and stuff but here's the dress um, what it will look like and yeah I'm really happy with my nail color I feel like it kind of complements it well it kind of almost it doesn't match it if you guys can see it's like a gray color but it does have lilac um, tones to it so yeah I just need to figure out what shoes I'm gonna wear let me go grab my two shoe options and show you guys okay so we can wear any shoes we want just nude so i have these are both from target yeah i think they are yeah both from target this is like a low heel and then this one's higher so let me show you guys the difference so they're both pretty short heels the wedding's outside we have to walk in grass so no like stilettos or anything um the higher one i think is i think i like this one more it has like a square toe and this one is just a round toe i'm gonna bring both though just to see how i match up with the groom's person that i'm walking with but yeah these are the shoes so new shoes and this um that is pretty much it i'm not gonna do a necklace my camera's gonna die because of this neckline of the dress but yeah i think i have makeup and hair down again by saturday my hair should have a little more volume and be more elongated but i think this is pretty much it so yeah this is my test makeup and hair but my camera's about to die so i will probably catch you guys once i actually get to kansas and i'll vlog a bit there um i still need to <laughs> paint my toes i'm just gonna do them white and i do them myself at home i have a gel and led kit so yeah i'm gonna do that tonight and then finish packing my things and cleaning up my makeup brushes